So today we're gonna ship out a Team GC electric skateboard to Rawang. So we're going to the post office now. And I'm using the new carbon fiber all terrain one wow hot plus because it's big so I can put the Team GC box in the middle. I always do this but I'm not sure if I can do this while holding a camera. So let's see and hope that I don't fall down. I don't think. Oh, speed bumps. Wait, can I do this? Another speed bump. The box will jump up with a speed bump. So you can definitely do this if you have two of your hands. But with a camera, with a hand holding a camera, it's quite hard. This is how you carry an electric skateboard with an electric skateboard. Okay, here it goes. All train electric skateboard carrying an electric skateboard. Oh, luckily the shop is closed. So if I fall down, no one's gonna see me. So as you, keep, as you can see, this board can totally go off road. Rocks and pebbles, dirt and sand. It won't be as comfortable as a pneumatic tire, but it is certainly possible. Because this is 6.5 inch rubber wheels. That's like big enough already. So we are cutting in slightly to the main road. But we are almost there. If you can see, that, that is the post laju. Cutting in to the main road. Woo. And we are there. What's up, Bintu Nia? Yeah. Okay. Ya, kalau yang kecilnya 20 km. Kalau yang besar ni 40. Patung tajah dia. Ha, kena cah. Ya, ni 26 ringgit 85. Benar 85. Dan now we are not going back home. We are going to go to for breakfast. We're going to go to the Balik Pulau food court. If you know it is at the Pasar Awan Balik Pulau, you can search it on the Google map. So we're going to go there by the main road. So now that we don't have the box in the middle, we can ride more aggressively and more fast. Oh, traffic. But luckily, we don't have to go through that. We're using a shortcut on the back road. There's like two sides of the food court. If you can see, this is the back side. Left is Chinese and right is Malay. And another side of this, same. Right is Chinese and left is Malay. So there's ton of foods here. You can check them out. I like to eat nasi dalcha here. You can try it. Uh, but no, I'm not using this road. Wait, I'm gonna make a U-turn. Oh, and by the way, this is like the worst road ever. Worse than off-road. If you know this kind of tarmac, it's like you can feel like your brain is shaking with it. Uh, so when commuting with electric skateboard, you wanna plan your road. You wanna know? Whoa, this is like the worst ever. <clears throat> you wanna know the good road and the bad road. And even if the good road is far away, you wanna choose the good road versus the bad road. Because if you ride it on a, if you ride an electric skateboard on a very bad road, 
you will reduce your lifespan of electric skateboard because road vibration will certainly defect and kill the electric skateboard the more vibration, the more the connection gets loose and the more problems you have so that's it, we're gonna hit for a breakfast and I'll see you guys in the next time